I think the greatest thing about having these two groups of artists come together from the US and from South Africa is that they're essentially both black populations on different continents that are in much different contexts, but then they come together to sort of have a shared and overlapping perspective on what does blackness mean to them and what do they see around them when they see blackness, when they think about blackness. And so everyone we've selected, you see their talent, but then behind the talent is their voice and their message and what really inspires them and compels them to create the art that they create. I want people to experience the show and not to be able to tell what art came from where so that you can see that we're all the same. See, that's, that's the thing. It's like, oh, that's South African. Oh, that's African-American. You see, that's a problem because if art becomes that thing that's a tell to say, well, um, I can tell that he's not African or I can tell that he's American or, you know, then we have not transcended the artistic or the creative borders as an artist. That means you're not mature. That means you're still in a little box trying to create something that's bigger than the box. Because your art, art is bigger than us. This piece is bigger than me, okay? And, um, and art should be like that. I cannot try to describe what a person should feel when they encounter a piece of artwork, particularly something that I did. All I know is that I created it out of a, a, a constant dialogue with the piece. I, I'm particularly interested in how people of African descent, Black folk, uh, react to and uh, uh, add to the conversation about the shape of Blackness. And then for our interested allies and non-Black folk interested in what uh, the shape of Blackness has to say, there's a learning opportunity and they too will have a perspective on how Blackness looks and perhaps what they what they have now been able to take away from some of the things that they've seen uh, in the exhibition that may have an impact on how they think about Blackness going forward. And so the great thing about it is that these are visual artists that are talking about essentially a visual idea, but not only are they artists, but they're all artists who have something to say. the opportunity to just think about and uh, reflect upon where Blackness is and how much more work there is to be done and yet how beautiful and brilliant and ingenious Black folk are. We start to realize that there's both an individual experience spread across our entire population, but there's also a shared experience. And it's that shared experience that we're gonna be able to take with us it's gonna allow us to accomplish even more as a people, not just black people, but people.